Indian squash player Ramit Pindan won a bronze medal in the Asian Games 2018. He also won three titles under the Professional Squash Association, PSA. Ramit said in the interaction with NNIS that his biggest goal is to join the top 10 squash players of the world. He also revealed that how he left cricket and opted for squash. I started at a very young age. I was around six or seven years old. Um, I had I had a good sports background. Um, my parents went to a lot of sports, especially my dad. My dad used to play squash. Uh, so I started off swimming, playing cricket because in India, I mean, cricket is the biggest sport. So everyone gives it a try. And uh, but my dad, as I said, was a squash player. So as every other kid, you always want to be like your dad. You follow him around, and and that's why that's how I started going to the club, following him, and, and trying to hit, play like him. And yeah, at the young age of six or seven, I think I picked up the sport. Uh, uh, it, it depends, like in practice or in the match. It's, it's two different uh, different scenarios. So in practice, probably the things I want to work on that particular day. Like as, as an athlete, you always have something in mind when you go to train. Like for example, one day you could be working on your fitness or one day you could be working on how you want to hit the ball, so it's usually that. And then during matches, it's very different. Every match is different. You we, we compete in different countries. We feel different on different days, so it just depends. Some days you're nervous, some days you're not. So there's no specific feeling, but there's always excitement, and I think that that's why I like uh, the sport so much. I mean, uh, the key the key to play squash or any sport, in fact, is you got to enjoy what you do. Uh, I know a lot of parents like kind of try to push their kids into certain sports that that does not work. It, it has to come from you. So do it if you if you like it, and if you do like it, then I mean the interest and the motivation and the dedication just comes along with it. So the key is just to enjoy your game and and uh, every time you play, take back something from every training session, learn something every day, and and as long as you're doing that, you're gonna keep getting better and better. So I would just say focus on the basics, but the key is to just love what you do. I mean, overall, yes. Um, 2018, like for me, I, I just started playing professionally late in 2017. So 2018 is kind of my first year competing professionally. And we had the Commonwealth Games, which was big for us. And then we had the Asian Games. And we won the bronze in the Asian Games. And uh, I think I won two or three PSA titles. Uh, so overall, yeah, I'm, I'm happy with the year. I'm happy with the way things progressed. But of course, there's also a lot to take back from the year in terms of bettering performances. So, uh, so yeah, I mean, you've got to learn from your failures and, uh, and you've got to enjoy the successful moments you had. So yeah, I'm pretty happy with the way 2018 went by. I mean, see, the goals are always to get higher up in the rankings. I mean, I'm looking first at top 30, then top 20, and then eventually it's going to be top 10. So uh, the goal is always to get better as, as time progresses. And uh, yeah, the, the short term goal would be first to break into the top 30. And then once I do that, eventually it'll be like to get into the top 10 of the world.